Hello, social media. Hello, you guys. How are you doing? Welcome. Hi, how are you? Well, welcome to Lakita T Sharp's exclusive inspirational channel. I am so happy that you have you are here with me, joining me on today. I'm happy that you are here. Hello, hello. Well, I guess you guys are preparing for the weekend, right? You guys are preparing for the weekend, I'm sure um, of it. Matter of fact, what day is this? Let me look and see what day this is, because I'm like, wait a minute, what day is this? Oh my gosh, it's Thursday. It is Thursday, isn't it? Well, anyway, welcome. So, let us go. Well, check out my books over at Amazon.com. And um, I am the number one brand for sensitive mind and sensitive soul books. And um, also... Head over to my website for additional inspiration. And if you want more, um, if you want to support my channel and what I am doing here, um, then thank you so much for supporting me. I want to give a shout out to Pastor Diana um, online community for reaching 100,000 subscribers. I am so proud of you. God is proud of you. And, you know, um, may you continue to push forward and continue to go in the direction that God wants you to go in. So anyway, all right, let us go, right? So we're going to talk about this. God is in control. God is in control of it. God is in control of everything. Let me tell you about this. Last night in the wee hours of the morning, I went to reach for my phone. And as I reached for my phone to make a call, the, my phone says that I wasn't part of a network and that I'm, my phone is not connected to a network. And I'm like, okay, um, I know I have more time to pay my bill. I'm like, okay, so what is the issue? Like, why is my phone saying not registered to a network? So then I reached for my other phone and it says it was no downtime, literally no downtime. So at that moment, I looked up to God, I looked up to the sky and I said, okay, what are you trying to tell me in this situation? Because I can't reach anybody. I can't make any phone calls. I can't do what I need to do. And I'm like, okay. So recently, you know, I've been thinking about, I was like, you know what, I may change my phone and even get an even cheaper phone line, you know, and save some money or whatever like that. So I've been thinking about that, you know, and so when, so when, um, that situation happened where the networks wasn't available and my phones wasn't working, it made me think, like, it had me think, like, okay, do you really want to get another phone company? Do you really want to transition? And so then it made me think, like, okay, well, um, you know what? Think about it. Think about it and transition. So I did that. Found another phone company and found some, a price that was is, is great, a great price. You know, so had had it not been for that situation happening with all the networks going down, comes to find out that it was a nationwide outage, you know, that happened on Thursday, which was today, you know, this morning. And um, being that that happened, I was able to think about 
may be transitioning to another phone provider. So guess what? I am here to say that God is in control. God is in control of that situation and what you are going through. He is in control of everything. Everything. I'm talking about even the phone lines that God is in control of. You mean to tell me I had all of my phones didn't work? You mean to tell me all of them didn't work? Come on now. Come on now. God was controlling the airwaves. And it's just like all of a sudden today, both of my phones, you know, started working. You know, just like that. Just like that out of nowhere. That is crazy. After I had made the decision to do what I was trying to do for a long time. So I'm here to say to you, I don't know what you are going through. I don't know what you are dealing with, but God is more than able to see you the root. He is more than able to help you through to the finish line. And I am here to say to you that God is going to bless you. I don't care what it may be looking like right now. I don't care what it, what you are going through, what are you are facing, what are you are dealing with. God is more than able to push you through and see you through this thing. You will overcome. You will make it. And you know, when you're walking around the house, when you're just walking around, start saying, God is taking care of it right now. God is paying my electric bill right now. God is paying my phone bill right now. God is helping me through it. Always include God. No matter what you are doing, always include God. And always know that God is with you on this journey. No matter what you are dealing with, no matter what you are going through, know that he got you every step of the way. You know, sometimes we go through trials and sometimes we go through tribulations. But I'm telling you that God will see you the real and he is going to bless you through this thing. You are coming out of it, whatever you are going through, you know, and you're going to make it through, okay? And um, God is going to bless you. So just know that this is confirmation that God is saying that he is in control of your circumstances, okay? And nothing is too far from him to do and to work in your life okay so you're gonna get through i know the situation may seem like it's dark i know the situation may seem like it's hard to get through but you're gonna overcome you guys are going to get through this thing you guys are going to overcome you guys are going to do well okay so just know that, you know, that God is going to elevate you. You're not going to be in these circumstances for a long time. Okay? So just know that, you know, he may be bringing you to this situation and just know that you have to go through in order to get to it. You have to go through it in order to get to it. So you will overcome. Okay? And um, God is going to bless you. Um, and you're going to push through. All right. Well, anyway, um, I love you guys. I will see you in the next video. And, um, you know, you guys are going to make it. You guys are going to get through. We are the chosen ones. We do right. 
We all right. We make a lot of mistakes. But we continue to move forward because why? We are the chosen. We are the chosen ones. I will see you in the next video. Bye.